Literally, if there's ore everywhere. <sighs> like, it's very, very good to have ore everywhere because that means you can get lots of ore and have lots of ore. Like, I don't know. It's just really boring to me if there's ore everywhere. I like it like this like it's it's more rare to find the ore so you actually have to work for it but when this ore like every everywhere it makes the game feel a little bit too easy I like actually having to work for it and let's get rid of this water so all you do to get rid of it is just do that and I'm suffocating in the sand. Ah. And then the water gets, or the sand gets rid of the water. Because it absorbs it. Uh, is it daytime yet? Nighttime goes by very slowly. Nope, it's not daytime. How about a little parkour? Oh, okay, maybe that was about a bad place to put that <laughs> Parkour there we go perfect Hey wait, I missed this. Oh wait. No, it's in a different cave. That's why I missed it Whoa a different cave Right. That didn't damage me though. Um, okay. Usually that would damage me. But it did not. Hey, you see me? See me? Come down here. Yeah, I know you want to come down here. Or not. Where the hell did you go? You trying to flank me? Asshole. Go away. Burn. Holiday spirits. I don't need holiday spirits. Hello. Oh, what are you? What am I talking about? You can't get up here. And it's another crappy cave. But I like it. Don't think I don't like it. <laughs> you know, it just means I get to explore more. I mean, sometimes that's, it's good to find lots of ore, but other times it's just nice to explore. caves <laughs> I could obviously dig straight down and find a cave but without a better pickaxe than the copper one I really don't feel like it and that would be an enemy so Oh, thank you for lighting up the area. I know there's coal over there now. <laughs> See, that's why it's not... Or, well, I wouldn't say good, but... It's good to move around on the surface in the daytime. Because you'll actually see ore that's in the ground. Because there's plenty of light.
There we go. Like now, see how f oh god, those are enemies. I thought they were peaceful guys, but they're not. See how far the darkness comes? Like right up like one block. So it's very hard to see anything further than or deeper than one block. So it's very hard to see if there's a war. But during the daytime it's a lot easier. Which is why I like walking on the surface during the day. I really need to look at the wiki and find out what the sun does. Or actually no, the sun... If I remember... I think I f remember it already. Oh, is that a chest? Yeah, it is a chest. It was blended in so well. Boom, let's use that. Learned a new blueprint. That blends in with the sand so freaking well. I had no idea that was a chest. I thought that was just more sand. But then I just looked a little bit closer. <laughs> That's so weird. I... You saw the chest my other guy had. I never found a chest like that. That's cool. And also discovering new things. That I've never seen before. That's also cool. Okay, that's kind of weird. He has like a... Like, uh, I don't like that face on when, <laughs> whenever I do that. Like, whenever I eat a bandage, he's like, Ew. <laughs> I mean, why the hell would you eat a bandage anyway? That's basically what you're doing. You're making a chomping sound as you're eating a bandage Whoa, hey, hey, Cole Okay, maybe I can go down here Didn't really completely explore this place, now did I? And there's copper there I need a lot of copper so I can make some copper armor. The good thing is, even the armor has upgrades. So, tier 1 armor uh, is basically you make copper armor first. And then you upgrade that copper armor with iron into the tier 1 armor. Or the tier 1 armor set. Same thing with when you get to level 2 or tier 2. You make uh, the armor with... What comes after iron? Uh, silver. Yeah. You make that armor with silver. And then you upgrade it with, I think... Um, steel and you get better are the tier 2 armor so yeah very nice so depending on how much copper we have which isn't a lot oh my god I need so much more Oh, it's daytime. Lucky me. I'm happy. <laughs> I can go romping around the planet again, or the surface, and look for ore. And I'm stuck again. Huh.
There we go. Get out of here. <laughs> I love this sword. This sword is so cool. Now I gotta keep my eye out for those chests because they're like really hidden. I probably, I may have ran into those chests in my other world. I just never knew because they're very hard to spot. Look at that. Now that you can see deeper underground, now that it's daytime, it's very easy to find pockets of ore like this. Very easy. I like it. Like it a lot. Burn. Oh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I just let the fire take care of him. <laughs> nice. going down. I mean, whenever I see sand, I just like to go down because there might be a lot of um, ore down here. There's some coal over there. <clears throat> and there's a piece of gold. One single solitary piece of gold. <laughs> uh, gold is kind of hard to find also, but like I said, the most the hardest thing to find is diamond. Or that I found. Not at my other world though, because I mean it is still hard, but it's like it's not in big Clusters? Well, sometimes it is. <laughs> it's just uh, not as hard in my other world. But it is still hard, so. I don't know if that makes sense or not. Whoa! Burn! That's gross. Keep your tongue in your in your eyeball. <laughs> Come on. Are you literally stuck? There you go. This looks like a good cave. Uh, I kind of want to stay outside though, because, like, just put double torches right there. I'll come back to this when it becomes night. And look, another chest. Holy shit, I almost missed it. I almost missed it. All you can, all you can tell is the seam, right down the middle. That's the only thing that tells me it's chest. <laughs> I almost missed it. <laughs> okay, I'll come back to that cave. Later. That does look a, like a really good cave, but like this, I want to stay on the surface. Specifically for this reason. Okay. 
Okay. There we go. Get out my weapon. A boss! Oh, God. I don't think I'm ready for this. Oh. Yeah, with that I'm really not ready. I thought that would be a lot better than that. Wow, that was not cool either. Come on, I know I have better stuff. Let's see. Let's use this. <laughs> oh. And this is how I deal with bosses. Because they usually kick my ass. Um. Okay, right now, um, you were just in the way. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Um. Hopefully he can't get through that. But I can. That's that's the key. <laughs> hey, hey. Okay, I'll just piss him off. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Holy crap. He is mad. And now I'm going to beat the shit out of him. <laughs> kind of cheap, but you know what? Whatever. <laughs> oh my god. Like I said, kind of cheap, but it works. So why not? He would literally kill me in one hit. Or he did attack me in one hit. But whatever. It still took a lot of health off. And he would have killed me really quickly. Usually when the when the music starts playing that means there's a something aggroed to you. <clears throat> okay, he dropped the weapon, so let's see what that weapon is. Alright, that does... It's, it does 10 damage. I can't really fucking see it. 10 damage... I'll try it out. It's two-handed. I like I like two-handed weapons. So let's try this out. It has a projectile. And it has poison. So it's basically the opposite of the sword that I just put away. It has basically the same left click. Just instead of fire, it's poison. Um, it looks cool. Is it any good though? I don't know. Oh, okay. I didn't want to aggro every single thing. Well, it has knockback, so that's the part that I like. Usually those swords with projectiles um, don't have knockback. So, I actually like this sword. I actually like it. And like I said about the cobblestone, this is cobblestone too. It's just, 
it looks different because it's in a different biome. Come on. Cobblestone is still hard to get through. Come on, please. Hurry up. Thank you. I just want to see what's over here. <clears throat> this won't really do... M oh, God. Eesh. Jump. Come on, jump. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> like I was saying, this won't really do much in here. This looks like another good cave too. Never mind. <laughs> uh, it looked like a good cave. Okay. Let's grab this. Or over here, get away, sand. Sand, sand, sand. Sand is annoying, but it, like I said, it's also very useful. One, it makes ore gathering very easy. And two, it, um, uh, what was two again? <laughs> uh, two was, um, Um, it gets rid of water, yeah. Like, it's a good way to get rid of water. And I'm gonna go back to that cave now, because it is becoming nighttime, and there we go. We are back. And there's an enemy! Which needs to be poisoned. And I need to watch my... Hello. Let's dig this out. There we go. And now, you know what? He's stuck and I want some meat. So I'm going to do this. And leather. Leather will do too. I'll need leather lighter. And he didn't drop anything. You know what? I will change that. There we go. Ha ha. And it swings pretty fast, too. I like it. And all this ore. Very nice. And it's in sand, which makes it extra nice. Because <laughs> it makes it easy, easier to gather. Going down. Grab this coal. 
Very cool. We're doing good for not having our <laughs> Usually, uh, well, I won't say usually, I've just played this game once before. But, I would like to kind of have armor at this point. Although at any time now, I can easily uh, call the first boss, but right now I don't think that's a really good idea. <laughs> Simply because I have no armor. At least I'm getting lots of coal. Very cool. Some planets, I'm not sure if they're only planets like level 3 or level 4 planets. But you can find like diamond on the surface when you're walking around like I was explaining during the daytime. You can find diamond up there on the surface, which is really cool. Which is very unexpected. I did not expect to see that. Diamond on the surface? What? Mm -hmm. Very cool. Huh. Oh wait, no. Uh, uh, come on, stop. Huh. There we go. Let's grab this iron. How much stuff do we have now? Uh, I don't know, because that is... Like, two ores make one bar, so I'm not sure. Uh, maybe I should keep going. Like, uh... I don't know, I'll just... Uh, hmm. How much more, or how much longer can I go? Well, I ran out of torches, but still I could go more. Ugh. Uh, let's just make some more torches. About 50 more should do nicely. There we are. Cool. Uh, put torch there. Because friendly. No ore over there. Let's try up here. No ore over there. It could be ore down there. To take care of this jerk first. Jerk. Okay. Um, torch. There. And there. Wait, is there? Nope. Okay. Let's chop this up. Down here. Uh, there's some iron. Nice. A little bit of gold. Uh, this is another dead end. There's like so many dead ends. Oh, I kicked my mic by accident. There we go. <sighs> okay. Um... Let's see.